About 1,500 tons of organic waste are produced in the city and 28,000 tons is collected and delivered to landfill every month. This poses a big environmental threat though people like Aguang Morris see it as an opportunity to innovate sustainable technologies to curb future environmental effects due to unplanned waste management strategies. Agate farming is one of newest waste management strategies that converts various organic wastes such as fruit, vegetable, industrial, abattoir and farm waste into an alternative protein for livestock, fish and organic fertilizer for plants and soil. It involves culturing and juggling with a four-cycle black soldier fly. The adult female fly lays between 500 to 1,000 eggs once in a bundle of tied pieces of wood or cut boards placed on top of rotting organic waste in a small container. These insects live for 10 to 14 days and are bred in a stiff net free from insecticides placed under transparent sheets or ultraviolet polythene. Creamish eggs are harvested by scrapping them off from the woods gently, weighed and placed on top of moist maize bran or brewery waste which act as a starter feed for young maggots after hatching for 5 to 7 day old larvae are then introduced to a bigger feeding area half filled with organic waste where they feed and grow from. In a period of 7 to 13 days, larvae is harvested and fed to fish or poultry in fresh form or dried and milled to mix with other livestock feeds. To have a fully sustainable operating black soldier fly farm, at this point a small percentage of about 20% is left to grow further which later turns into a pupae stage in 14 to 18 days which is harvested, cleaned and put back into the breeding net and the cycle continues. However, consistency in proper management is key to keep the farm active, waste availability and protection from intruders like rats and red ants. For more information contact Morris by commenting on this channel.